And if you don't do it, you're fired. And I see you do it again, you're gone. And anyone on this crew does it. That's it. And you too. And you too. And you. Don't you ever do it again. The global pandemic that brought this world to his knees is not over yet, not by a good margin, and as such, people and companies and various other establishments have to go and take many, many measures to ensure that they, their workers, and their customers are safe from any kind of harm. At first, this may sound basic, and yet things are still getting broken in terms of protocol, and some people in particular are really not happy about it. One of them being Tom Cruise. It allows to break it down for you, but first, be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. You want the chance to win a brand new iPhone 12, MacBook Pro, or a $500 Amazon gift card. Find the hidden message that's in this video, comment it down below, and subscribe to the channel for a chance to win one of these amazing prices. Number four, the Mission Impossible incident. So let's get right to it, shall we? Right now, Tom Cruise is making Mission Impossible 7, the latest in his very long line of Mission Impossible films. And as you would expect, there are strict protocols for movie sets and the people that work on them, which apparently Tom takes very seriously. As first reported by The Sun, after Cruise saw two crew members standing too close to one another in front of a computer screen, he told the crew, if I see you do it again, you're effing gone. I don't ever want to see it again! Ever! And if you don't do it, you're fired! And if I see you do it again, you're gone! Number three, was it too much? Given the not so even Neil that Tom Cruise has had over his career, see jumping on the couch on Oprah and his interview with Matt Lauer that almost ended his career, you'd be reasonable to think that this is just another Tom Cruise moment. But it's not, and if you listen to Tom's rant, he's not doing the rant because he wants to keep working per se, he's doing it because he knows that there are thousands of people who need to keep their jobs. Hollywood as a whole took one of the biggest hits during the pandemic. Movies had to be delayed in theaters because the theaters were closed. TV shows that were filming had to shut down and cut seasons short because they couldn't film. And even though now films and TV are shooting, they're under high scrutiny. There have already been viral outbreaks on shows like The Witcher and movies like The Batman where the star himself, Robert Pattinson, got infected and everything had to shut down. If a production shuts down, that's at least a few days not working as they do contact tracing and try to make sure no one else is infected. For that production, that's a lot of money lost and time they're going to have to try and make up and a time crunch that no one wants. So as you can see, it wasn't too much. It was just right in terms of what needs to go on. Number two, Tom Cruise, people's champion. Yeah, that might be a little bit of a stretch, but it's true enough because again in his rant, Tom Cruise was noting that he was wanting to make sure the protocols were followed because thousands of jobs were on the line in many respects. He didn't want a single person to lose their job because two people weren't following the protocol. In truth, this is the kind of mentality that all the major stars of Hollywood should be taking right now. Everyone needs to be accountable from the top down. Number one, accountability. We're pretty sure we don't need to tell you that the pandemic isn't over yet and that it's not just Hollywood and international movie sets that need to be monitored here. Everyone needs to do their part to try and get through this. Even when it's inconvenient or you think you're being restricted, you need to keep doing the things that will get us better. So please wear a mask, maintain social distancing when you can, and if you think there's a small chance you have the virus, go get tested just to make sure. The last thing we need is for the infection to spread. And there you have it everyone, a look at Mission Impossible and Tom Cruise and how a breach in pandemic protocols led to him going ape on his crew. Can you believe that this set off Tom Cruise? Are you glad that it did set him off because he wants people to be safe and their jobs to continue? Do you wish that more people blew up like Tom Cruise did? Let me know in the comments down below. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time on the channel.